Greetings, I'm Demonac, and it's arena time. All right, three wins, one loss. Let's see what the hell we turn into this time. <clears throat> yeah, we've done we've done okay sometimes with transforming with the embrace the light or whatever crap that thing is. And we won at least once without doing that, which is a bit stranger because. The Warlock component of this deck is not the strongest, but eh, we'll see what happens. Probably won't be boring. Unless my computer lags out, which would make no sense. I just tested most of this stuff, like, what the hell? You can tell the difference between, like, live recording and, like, doing other stuff. Mostly that probably means that Exploit's taking a lot of resources, but... Uldan versus <sighs> okay. I will fight with honor. You know, I got chilling, chilling Tunneler so I can beat the crap out of myself some more. Do I keep the... I think I keep the starting hand spreading madness, even though it's probably dumb. Oh, good. The tentacle makes me feel better. That's not a sentence I, off, I utter frequently. Reporting for duty. But this guy makes me feel a lot better about the potential life loss from him. However, initially, it looks like I'm just going to take the visa. I'm not going to coin out the the gastropod just to take out two one ones, am I? Because if there's too much stuff out there, I can just spreading madness. Although it's pretty ridiculous. Reporting for duty. Okay. Um. Okay, well, I was going to coin out the tentacle, but actually, I'm just going to play this. It's not like I have anything to protect. And he's going to heal me, which means my opponent's going to want him dead. And it would take all three of them to kill him. He'd technically die. The tentacle wouldn't without some kind of assistance, Back but eh. Homes. Okay, that guy does need to die. Really? Okay. So I could hit her for two and then spreading madness and hope that it gets her. I think there's a reasonable chance. I mean I could take a lot of damage from this, but let's let's do that. That seems like the thing to do. Probably stupid, but oh, there we go. So I've taken a lot of beatings, but that was okay for card advantage, I think. Not giving him a bubble is also nice. I don't really want to play a whole lot of Chittering Tunnelers right now. Um, do I need a card from this? Not so much, but I don't really want to take the life loss from him. Well, I mean, he'll give me good stuff, but let, let's, let's just play this, it's fine. Uh, I don't know how this is going so far, honestly, it's kind of weird. That's not helping so much. Doom, I'm getting all that stuff. Um, really am taking the beatings. I could just play this, then it gets killed by the 2 1, so that doesn't help much. Alright, let's see what I get from this guy. Something that kills him? No. Oh. I guess I could siphon soul him next turn, but he's going to do some damage in the meantime. Oh, we'll still take this. I am going to coin out the tentacle, I think. Because the 3-1 guy can't solo that tentacle without help. <clears throat> For not attacking, I'm probably going to get Consecrated or something, but just throwing my guy away to do 2 damage to this also doesn't seem like the best. Not that that helps. No, this could be worse. We'll renounce darkness later. Because right now we can do this. And this. And why not that? I mean, I'm kind of in trouble. But I've got 
slightly more cards. My opponent is playing early game stuff. I might have more chance to come back. Ugh. That's a pretty strong pair of Murlocs. And that doesn't help. God damn. Now I can't just protect myself with a big taunt. <sighs> I mean, I could renounce darkness, but I'm not sure that's what I want to do, although my hero ability is pretty freaking useless right now. I'm close to being able to play him. I'd be a lot closer if I still had my coin. But I, that's, he's no good without with, with that there. God damn. I can play this and I can play him, but it's not going to get me very far. Random demon. Not bad. The opponent's nearly out of cards, but I'm nearly out of hit points. It's a priest me or something. Yeah. So you can do that and get rid of the 6-6. Six, six. But then he doesn't have that much in play, so what's his card? Does he have any big cards? I think she's potentially dangerous, but not really what I was worried about in terms of big cards. I really can't afford a lot of this. Like, he might just kill me. Speaking of might just kill me, god damn it, it's just not quite enough. There was a point earlier in the game where that would have been super useful. Close to Doom, but I, I don't think it's actually what I need. I think I need maybe to renounce Darkness. Like holding out to Doom is tempting, but I gotta play him next turn, and that Doom is so far, even though it's only two mana away, it's so far away. Let's see what I get out of this. Four damage and restore three, four health to your hero. Well, that works out decently. Totem, and play this guy, just jump blocks. Oh boy. So I've got a hero power now, which I didn't when I was that low in health, basically. Or especially when I had more cards. Ironically, now I've played a bunch of cards, so now I could use that hero power, but I really don't have the health. Ugh, that's really bad. Yeah, of course he gets the plus three attack. That's really bad. I'm going to have a hard time coming back from this. Excuse me. That's not what I expect to go to class cards. So, wow. I just really have to kill those mostly. And I guess I've got this to protect me, so I guess we'll do that. That's a no-brainer. Would I rather kill one of them or him? Probably one of them. Sad though it may be. Because that makes my 610 more likely to do anything. I don't know though. I don't think I I don't think I've stabilized enough. Okay, I haven't stabilized enough for friggin' Ultra Sword. Just attach me for okay, random, but fine. Uh I I'm not gonna be able to get through that Ultra Sword. But I can wind speaker this guy and kill everything else. So we'll do that. Feel the power. <clears throat> Probably be cranking this thing to try and get myself a taunt totem. That's not a taunt totem. This will grow the longers out. She's going to give me tiny crap minions. That's not too worthwhile. This will turn into a random six cost minion, and he's costing me three, so that's really good value, but I think I'm better off putting this out right now. Could be totally wrong. I don't know. That old disorder does not have to hit me a whole lot. I have to kill it somehow. That's more big crud that I can't handle. That's probably another three damage to me that I can't stop. Gone through a bunch of taunt. I don't have the swamp things this time. Uh, let's see if Lotus Agents will give me something to save my butt. That's a tough one. Devolve would be bad. Because he's going to turn into a 5 cost, he'll turn into a 5 cost, it'll turn into something big and heal itself, but it's not going to work out well in this case. The Phantom Knives will kill some damage, reduce the number of targets. So I think it, I think it's got to be the Phantom Knives for sure. I can do that and still play this. The, uh, 2 damage is pretty good. 
Okay, let, let's just do this first. Let's see what I draw, etc. I can't afford to take it right now. I really gotta kill that. that. Well, this guy would be really good to get out. Let's see if I get a taunt totem now. It's one in three. I do. Do I kill the Ultra Sword or this guy? I, I'd have to use both of them, so I might as well just kill him. It's one less damage. Unless my opponent has a way to heal that. I am so gonna die soon. I'm trying. Taking forever to put this guy out is not helping, is it? Oh, God damn it. Now he's getting just fat after fat after fat. I am not gonna be able to compete. That is some taunt. It's like tiny, tiny taunt. And even with the cheaperness, I can't do him and the other thing, but. Oh, these guys can't even kill that. Oh, god damn it. I wonder. Just trying to get another taunt. I gotta get another taunt to him or I'm dead, I believe. As much as I'd rather do these other things, the one in three chance of taunt is probably more likely to save my life. If he can kill a 1-1, one, one, so then he's going to kill me. Oh, man. All right. I'm relying on his inability to kill a 1-1 one, one from his hand. I, I gotta try and do more than just that. I'm gonna try and put out the bouncer here. I'm gonna throw this guy away too, cause why not? So I'm probably dead. Again, all he's gotta do is kill that 1-1 one, one taunt and I'm obliterated. Or do like one or two damage to me. There's so many ways I could die. That's not helping. I don't have enough damage out there to kill that thing. Oh, I super don't have enough damage out there to kill that thing. That's not gonna help. No, I've got I've got nothing now. Because I'd have to use this guy to kill that, and then I don't have enough to kill the other one, and there are all those other guys. Taunt totem? It is a taunt totem. It, I, it's not enough now. Yeah, this is his one too many hit points on there. Otherwise, I'd be okay. He only needs the 1-1 one, one to get me, so yeah, just could not do it. He had all this like cheap, 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 cheap stuff, and then when it got to the end, when we, when we both had the man and it was super important, he was just like, fat, fat, fat. The double, the double chemists were pretty strong too. That was super good. Okay, sudden death now. Three wins, two losses. Oh, it's not even really three wins because one of them was a freebie. Yeah. I mean, this deck isn't that great, but I was hoping I could do more because of the embrace. The embrace is kind of strong. If, if it comes in early game, it's pretty good. Would I have been better off hanging on to that doom? I don't know. I think I would have been just getting stomped an extra two turns, or an extra, at least an extra one turn before I could get to the Doom, and you saw how low I was for most of that time. I don't think I could have taken much more. I needed to get out things when I did. As nice as Doom would have been. Oh, a Paladin. Hooray. It's not the same one, right? Nope. <sighs> Hellfire too late last game. Early in the game it would have been useful. However, do I hang on to it? I don't think so. I gotta go for things I can cast more, even though the tunnelers murder me. Ah, oh, <laughs> I'm gonna be hurting. They give you cards, but they hurt. They're so not the like ivory knights. Wow, same start as for my opponent. That's that's fabulous.
Well, since I have literally nothing to do, I might as well draw a card. Ow! God damn it! That is some serious damage. I mean, he fights them as well as the Chitterers. I'm going to take the damage from the Chitterers eventually. I'm going to be dead by then. Th that that one-two punch rush is actually just going to kick my ass. Oh, you're going to use them to kill him. You're not rushing me as hard. Hooray! I'm filling my hand with crap, but... Um, I'll, I'll survive that. Um, here, I would like you to trade both your guys to kill this. Gadgets and Gazette always get the scoop. I mean, you could do the same thing with him. This this tends to draw more aggro somehow. Life juggler. Damn it. Damn it! That's pretty annoying. One turn away from this guy. Well, let's get suicide some more, I guess. You get a redounce darkness now, but I'm about to start doing good things with the Warlock cards. Let's take the Shadow Flame, because it's quite excellent. Play my crap elementals. I'm going to be at 10 even faster this game. This is not working out. That is not helping. Wow. I, I'm, I, this is going to be too slow. I'm not going to be able to get out the guy to do it with in time. Or, I guess my opponent is not killing this guy, so I could do it. I would still be in a not great situation. I don't have enough mana to buff him and then do it either. Ugh. Like, this would kill those 1-1s, one -ones, but that wouldn't be enough. He's going to get two one ones back. I'm still going to be so really screwed. Possibilities. Uh, I really need to be able to do this, and then I'd be okay if I was actually clearing the board except for the one ones, but no. I can't even attack with him first because there's taunt there, so, yeah. So many possibilities. No, I just got to take kill those guys all and take my lumps. Rushed. <laughs> I'm already almost dead. I don't have any taunt that is like castable. Oh, oh, actually dead? Four, eight, not quite. Can't use my hero power, that's no surprise. That's not even helpful. Awesome. Well, the only thing you could possibly do it would be Bane of Doom, some crazy taunt demon, and even then I'm probably just dead. Nope, that is a crazy non-taunt piece of crap demon. So, the incredibly suicidal suicide warlock, not the greatest. But I, in my defense, those were some crazy, crazy rushes. I really wasn't drawing my friggin' tar creeper, which is what I need to keep me alive for that through that stuff. Or, that game, the tentacle probably would have held. If I had the 2-4 tentacle, it would have done pretty decent, but no. Yeah. Space doesn't... The pack is really stupid. Blocked by those unopenable packs. Well, that's different. I did not have him. After you summon a minion, trigger its death rattle effect. That is a cool power, and it's going to be pretty relevant when a new set comes out. I think tomorrow. So, yeah, we'll just have to see what happens when all the new cards from the Frozen Throne hit the arena next time. Please click the legendary like button. And don't forget to subscribe to Demonet Games for more Hearthstone Arena and other gaming videos.